bagyo sa balak ng kinabuhi. Kada segundo, gaguros ang unos, din sa sulod sa akong hunos. Din akong ititigan ang mga pulong na sa akong alimpulo galirong. Usahay, signos numero uno. Huwag ang akong bagul-bagul mabuto. Mabot na galing sa numero dos. Manabako na kumiana o tustos. Sa panahon nga ang signos numero tres, musabat ko sa singgit sa bisibis. Numero kwatro, mutago na ko sa kwarto. Numero singko, masuko na ko. Apan inigpatak sa size nga numero. Mao na kini ang peligro. Pugngan ko na kining dagang nga mao'y akong hinagiban kay mahadlok ko sa unos nga gahagurus sa numero 7 nga signos. Diin mapalid ang mga pulong lapos sa simintong bongbong ug ang mga higanting balod mula mo'y sa tanan ng mga balaod na maoy gapugong ni ining gabuswak kong mga pulong. I'm Maria Victoria Beltran but I think a lot of people calls me Bambi. I went to UP Diliman, finished biology, didn't go to med school and so there was a stage in my life I didn't know what to do. I got married very young got divorced very young too and then I met the German guy. We were together around 16 years and it was during that time that we did a lot of things. We opened the cuckoo's nest. I became a scuba dive instructor. We had a small resort in Mualboal and in between all these things I went back to school and took up fine arts. And that's when I started painting. I started writing poetry and fiction and essay. And in 96, film entered my life. Great ideas can come from anywhere. And great ideas stay in your head and in your heart and tortures you until you do something about it. My first story that became a film, Damgun Eleuteria. I wrote it in one go, like I cannot stop. That's when I think this must be a really good idea. Writer's block is only for lazy writers. Yeah, but it does happen. But if you have a great idea, you never will have a writer's block. You know, my mom used to tell me, I do so many things. My mom used to tell me, can you concentrate on one thing? So I say, no, I'm born to be a Jill of all trades and master of none. I cannot just don't do art anymore. Yeah. There's something lacking if I don't produce anything. Maybe it makes me less, <laughs> less grumpy. And <laughs> life is art. Art is life. It's in my blood now. There's no escaping. <laughs> A long time ago, when my German boyfriend passed away, a lot of my writer friends invite me for workshops, you know, to make me busy and to feel happy or whatever. They tricked me into writing Balitao. It's an old Cebuano form of poetry. My mentor, Dr. Alburo, told me, if you don't write, nobody represents Cebu. You can turn anything into inspiration. Good time, bad time, try to change it, use it as an inspiration to do your art. I always say, when you write, you really write sincerely. Honestly, it has to come from your heart and soul because nobody has the same heart and soul like yours. So it becomes original. Persistence, making a name for yourself does not happen after one film or one book. Just do, 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 do. Produce, produce, create, create, create. 